It's going to be nice out there yeah. again today, but we're going to start to see things changing a little bit. Gets a little bit warmer today, and then that moisture begins to increase as we head late into tonight and tomorrow. So that could set us up for a few showers and storms middle of the week. We'll talk more about that, and that all has to do with Francine that we'll talk more in detail about coming up a little bit later as well. But in the meantime, taking you out to Denton, it is nice still and cool. 53 degrees there. We'll have the clear skies here for you this morning. And as we look elsewhere around 54, heading over to Plano along with McKinney and Wiley this morning coming out to DeSoto and Lancaster, you're in the lower 50s over to Arlington at 54 and 55 as we get out to Weatherford. So enjoy these temperatures. They will start to come up. This will be the yeah, last cool, very comfortable morning, I think, for us out there before those temperatures begin to rebound a little bit more. As we've mentioned, those highs do bounce back a little bit, but still below normal today. We'll be in the upper 80s heading out toward Greenville around 88, 89 or so heading over to Denton, and we'll have those upper 80s a little farther west. So that normal high of 90 degrees will be a little bit below that today, but those temperatures will We'll climb a little bit more as we go through the week. Now we will have some rain chances. We're going to be talking a lot about what's happening out in the Gulf with Tropical Storm Francine. It will strengthen, becoming a hurricane a little bit later today as it makes its way toward the Louisiana coast. Now we're going to be on the back side of that, but you see the outer edges of that circulation will begin to pump, pump that Gulf moisture into east and southeast Texas here as we head into tonight and for tomorrow. And then we will begin to see at least some isolated to scattered showers and thunderstorms in our area as we get into tomorrow. So here's how it will look as far as the chances are concerned back over toward the Metroplex only isolated activity, but it will increase to scattered in our far eastern counties and obviously likely the closer to that center of circulations. We could have some brief tropical downpours out there. Those winds may kick up a little bit as well. As we look at our time cast heading on into Wednesday, you see the isolated to scattered activity. There may be a few showers around for Wednesday morning, and then as we get into the afternoon, that starts to pick up a little bit, so we'll have that activity around. Just something to keep in mind on Wednesday. We will have those lower in rain chances, but coverage very it's going to be very limited, so a trace to about a tenth of an inch, but you see that does increase through Friday as we head a little farther east. So here's that forecast for you upper 80s today and tomorrow right through Thursday with that slight chance for some showers and storms right now. We're putting that coverage at about 20% and then here comes the heat once again by the weekend. It is going to be hot. It is going to be humid, so summer though summertime temperatures do come back for us as we'll be in the upper 90s on Saturday and Sunday, so be prepared for that and then we'll have some slight chances for showers and storms next week and those temperatures do come down just a little bit as well.